suggestion, Sammy, to get it from down low. Yeah. Um. And Columbia Houston, uh, Columbia Houston, we would suggest while you have the handle off, go ahead and cycle the locking mechanism to verify that it appears to be functioning properly. I tell you what, that's just what uh, Mom ordered. Uh, what we'd like now is to have uh, Tammy uh, try to activate the lock and unlock mechanism and then try the handle again. Although you've got a, such a good view, we can even read the unlocked on the tab. Houston, uh, we're uh, ready to complete the survey, and we just saw a pretty uh, good bit of motion there in the linkage. Yeah, we see the motion in the linkage. What we've discovered so far, Bill, with the inner hatch handle on the outer hatch is that um, it doesn't matter whether the inner hatch handle is locked or unlocked, we still get about that same 30 degrees of play on the rotation of the handle, and we see the mechanism that the linkage is moving in response to that, but at some point, at that 30 degree point, something jams, and right now our thinking is that that jam is occurring at the hub of the, um, of the latch handle mechanism. Uh, we copy, Taco. 
We copy and uh, and for uh, Tammy and Tom, uh, uh, rest assured we're working hard to see if we can't uh, figure out a way to get you guys uh, out the hatch as soon as possible. They appreciate that, Bill. Timeline. Go ahead for timeline. Bill, we're going to put a little bright spot in our day and, and schedule a Thanksgiving dinner uh, sometime in, in about a half hour or an hour from now, uh, if that works out with your plans, and uh, maybe we can schedule our troubleshooting around that dinner time. And we copy. We think that'll work just fine. Uh, to let you know, just a big picture, and we'll have some more details later uh, for you. Uh, what we're planning on doing is trying to make tomorrow uh, to, to preserve the option for tomorrow to look like just like today, uh, hopefully with a little more positive results. Uh, but basically, to gain an extra hour uh, or gain back the extra hour that you had today, uh, you know, you were going to uh, shift one hour to the right today. So our plan is. Uh, to have you to move all your activities one hour earlier uh, to get you to bed an hour earlier so that uh, you wake up tomorrow at the same time you woke up today. So that will give you the one hour of extra time tomorrow uh, in case uh, we can uh, get, all that, you know, get all these uh, problems sorted out. And so then tomorrow night you would uh, get that uh, sleep shift uh, one hour to the right. talking a few minutes ago. Today didn't go exactly as we had hoped. We've got high hopes for tomorrow and the rest of this flight, but we still have a lot to be thankful for, and we're really happy about being up here, uh, about working with such a fine team that we have on the ground, and, and uh, just real thankful about this American Space Program and how far it has got and uh, the things it is doing, and we hope we can keep going with it tomorrow. Thanks, Taco. We copied and uh, just want to uh, assure everyone that uh, we're putting the first team on this, and uh, we're going to uh, we're going to work hard, and we're going to put this uh, we're going to figure out this uh, airlock uh, hatch problem and uh, get you guys out the next opportunity. Thanks, Bill. We have every confidence. 